You may have problems with Fortnite FPS drops and stuttering and so on, but I'm here to help you make your game like this so perfect and smooth and playable, even on epic settings. After Fortnite Chapter 6 Season 3, many users were facing problems like this about FPS drops and stuttering problems. As you can see right here, my glider effects is not showing on time and it's taking so long to show. And the game is so laggy and FPS is dropping to zero, which is making the game unplayable at all. But don't worry, because after this tutorial, your game will be like this even on epic settings. So stay with me and let's go. So we have five steps to tweak our gaming PC for Fortnite. Then please listen to me carefully and stay with me till end of the video. First of all, open your Epic Games Launcher and log into your account. Go to your library and find Fortnite and click on these three dots and click on option. Here make sure to uncheck high resolution textures and check pre-download streamed assets. Now click on apply and you may have to wait a little or a while depends on your connection speed to download around 9 gigabytes of file. As you can see everything is downloaded perfectly and game is playable. But wait, go back to the option and try to be sure everything is like as I said. After that just close the epic games and let's go to the next step. So maybe you didn't notice but Windows is using too much of your CPU power. Just take a look here. It's almost 240 process which is happening just by Windows. I didn't open any applications yet. But don't worry, leave us for now, we will figure it out in step 4 and 5. For now, let's just update our graphic drivers. Doesn't matter you have AMD or Nvidia graphic cards. I will leave link of both of them in the description below. Just update your graphics driver to the latest stable version. And if you are on AMD, use the performance mode and that's all for now. And let's go to the next step. So we need driver booster to boost all of our other drivers. Don't worry, it's completely free. Also, I will leave the link in the description below. After downloading the application, just click on install button and decline optional offers agreement. We will not need them. And wait a little till application installed completely. After that just ignore the subscription and click on scan now. And the application will start to scan all of your missing drivers or outdated drivers. After scanning is finished, just click on update now, sit back and try to drink coffee. I'm just kidding, it's not taking so long, maybe one or two minutes. Also depends on internet speed and your computer speed. First the app will download all of the drivers, after it will install all the drivers. When it's finished, reboot your computer and let's go to the next step. Now we need really nice free and open source application called Winhance. Also link in description. This is the perfect application to enhance your Windows PC and make it free out of bloatware and unnecessary Windows applications. Download and install it. If you got this error message from Windows, don't worry, just click on run anyway. And install for all users. So as you can see there are too many tweaks on this application, but just do something that I'm telling you. In the first page or first tab, check all of the applications and after that uncheck the necessary applications that you may need in future. For example, I will need Notepad, Photos and other applications. But the rest of them like Microsoft OneDrive and other applications better to be removed because they are using too much processing power of your CPU. After that, click on Remove Selected Items. A window will pop up to you and it's showing you the applications that gonna be removed. Just hit on OK and sit tight till the software doing its job. After everything finished, close the application and if you wanna support the creators of this application, hit on yes. If no, click on no. And if you wanna support me, please hit the like and subscribe button and let's go to the next step. So for the last step, hit Windows key on your keyboard and write CMD and open command prompt with administrator privileges. You can right click on it and run as administrator. And just copy this command from description and paste it here and hit enter. 
Okay, with this tweak, you can install as many applications as you want, but we don't need them. Just head to the tweaks tab and just please copy after me. If you want to know each one of them is doing what thing with your computer, just hover your mouse on them and it will show you details of each one. After that, click on run double O shut up 10, click on actions tab and hit on apply recommended settings and click yes. And we are good to go and perfect. Now close this tab and you may see this message which is telling you you have to restart your PC for applying all of the effects. But for now, please don't restart your PC because we are not finished yet. Now head to the customize preferences and please copy after me because I don't want to waste the time of the video. You can pause the video and take a look and just copy after me and click on the add and activate ultimate performance profile. Now if you go to the config tab and click on the power plan, you can see the crease type Titus ultimate power plan which is activated. Now head back to the tweaks tab and hit run tweaks. Don't worry in all of these steps we have restore point. So if anything bad will happen to your windows you can go back to the default settings. But don't worry I tested everything is perfect. Once you see this message two weeks are finished and now you can close the cmd and the application will close automatically now hit the start or go to your start menu hit settings go to the gamings make sure the gaming bar is turned off and make sure the game mode is turned on and now just restart your pc and let's see what we did with our pc and let's go to try fortnite here we go let's go to the task manager and see how much process we have it's perfect we have maximum 120 process that if you compare it with 240 it's fantastic as a bonus step you can hit the windows key and write advanced system settings and head to the settings again and choose best performance and that's all let's run epic games and try to play fortnite and see the problems fixed or not so we are starting with 155 fps which is amazing as you can see my glider doesn't have any problems no stuttering anymore no lags anymore the game is so smooth and so perfect when you're landing the fps is going up to 120 130 and minimum is not zero anymore and you can play so nice and so easy without any problems and struggling with gpu or cpu or anything else and as you can see average fps is 115 up to 120 for epic settings which is fantastic and also i'm playing on hdd not on ssd which can cause stuttering a little also if you lower the settings to the medium it can go up to 300 fps now just take a look as my gameplay not so professional just to show you tweaks are working so perfectly so please if this video worked for you and you use these tweaks let me know in the comments and please hit the like and subscribe button and send it to your friends who has problems with fps drops and similar problems thanks for watching and see you in the next video